What's up, gang? Kurt here, and this is my SBDC055 Seiko Diver, the Paddy Diver, or the Paddy Moss, as some like to call it. And today we're going to put it on a bunch of different straps, and uh, let's just get right into it. Pew, pew. Okay, we have it on the first strap. Of course, I had to put it on a sailcloth strap from Mr. Sailcloth. It had to be done. You know it had to be done. And, uh... It looks pretty freaking cool. Let me just give it a little wipey wipe here just to get off the little dust particles. And uh, look at that. I think it looks pretty cool. A little bit of a dip here because it's been used. But uh, what do you think about that action right there? It looks pretty cool. I wish uh, I wish the blue... Actually, the blue matches pretty good with the bezel. It's, it's a good package. Let me put it uh, on my wrist. That's what she said. Let's put it on my wrist real quick. The black background of my little set here looks like it's smiling little happy face little, little happy face no I killed it I killed it I killed the face all right there you go that's the patty moss on the on the blue stitched silk cloth strap looking pretty sweet let's just get a little bit closer here up in personal mmm 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 would you just look at that that is the sexiness for sure put a link to these in the amount section below this is the uh, Patty Moss on the Mr. Sailcloth blue stitch strap. Okay, here we go. We have it on a Barton autumn color canvas strap, and it is autumn. Well, actually, in about three days, officially, it'll be autumn. I think three days? In about three days, it'll officially be autumn, September, 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 September 22nd. And I think it's a really fun color to wear for your autumn uh, dress attire desires. The color is slightly more orange in this view, but it's it's a little bit more pink in real life. And I think it's weird. This is a weird combo. All the people that are purists will be like, You can't use a canvas strap on a dive watch. Are you crazy? Yes, I am. I mean, obviously, I'm off my rocker because I have freaking puppets and I lost the keeper. I have lost the keeper. Oh, no. Video is over. Video is over, guys. Just kidding. <laughs> I have the keepers on my desk somewhere, but um, pretty cool. I didn't show you on my wrist. I, I, I digressed into uh, just trying to save face because I lost the keeper. But uh, let's just let's just not worry about that and put it back on my wristicle and uh, just kind of deal with it. Okay, there you go. There you go on my wrist. Sans the keeper, and uh, I think it looks pretty good. It doesn't doesn't quite really match but that's okay because we don't really need things to perfectly match it just kind of has to contrast nicely uh, but yeah that's the Barton canvas on this patty moss <laughs> okay this is Barton's flat water elite silicone strap and it is magnificent it is a kind of a like a light a shallow blue and uh, a sky blue underneath very nice beautiful strap and I actually bought this one because I, I wanted to support the cause uh, part of the proceeds uh, from this watch goes to charity and uh, you can find about, more about that from Barton but this is a fantastic freaking strap I love it now it's a little bit deeper blue in like, my camera but uh, suffice to say that it looks good let me put it on my wristicle and let's get it on there real quick guys Mm -mm 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 -mm. This one is not going to have a keeper flub like the last one. I uh, went to my desk and I couldn't find it. But there you go. Look at that. Mm -mm, Betsy. Look at that. That is so good. Yeah. It does. It does match ridiculously well with all the things. With all the things. I'm too far in there. And uh, because you got that, uh, that, that nice blue coloring with that light blue top that kind of blends in with the bezel it's a nice choice this is really good this is really really good um I, I i'm in love with these elite silicones i don't want any other silicone strap in my life uh because i just why why would i want anything else these when you when i find perfection i'm going to keep it but you know uh, there's maybe something else that's going to come along that I might like better. <laughs> but anyway, this, there's a bunch of different colors I want to show you. So let's get into a bunch of different ones. Again, it's redundant, but here we go. This is the gray version. It's a smoke gray. I think it's called smoke gray. And uh, really cool. I like this combo. It's kind of a little bit more subdued. It's got a black bottom and uh, a little bit more subdued 
but I do like it. It's not my favorite combo, but I would wear it. If I wear like a gray shirt or something, I would rock this one if I wanted to wear this watch. Okay, next color. This is a chocolate brown-ish colored strap. That's not the greatest, not my favorite. It's a tan underneath. It, it works well with many other watches, just not quite this one. But then again, it's it's also very weird. Um, I would rock it again if I was wearing like a brown shirt, but if I was wearing a brown shirt, I would probably wear a completely different uh, watch. But yes, yeah, so it's an elite brown strap from Barton. Elite silicone brown strap. Next one. Okay, navy blue. Navy blue all around. Navy blue Barton elite silicone. This is probably the matchiest matchy of all these straps. Uh, but I'm kind of sick of navy blue straps. Am I the only one? Am I the only one that kind of thinks that? that na I'm just kind of over just a constant uh, barrage of navy blue straps that I see on Instagram. I don't know. I just made it up. I love this thing. It's really good. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, really cool but my favorite one is the one that's coming up after this <laughs> all right look at that orange you glad I brought this one out wah, wah, wah. okay guys this is my favorite one I don't know why it's just weird it's just weird it does doesn't even match anything on this watch but it just somehow works really well I love this combo that blue and orange just kind of complements each other well and uh, when I wear it, I just I just love looking at it. Let me put it on my wrist. I'm gonna put this one on my wrist, guys, because I just do super love this uh, this thing of a bobber. I put it on the wrong way, but that's okay. So I was in a rush. You guys know that I am not the greatest at doing things properly. <laughs> but there, there you go. Look at that. I think that is fan freaking tastic. Let me get a zoomy zoom here. Look at that. It just it just blows my ass right open uh, how well this combo looks in my opinion. Uh, yeah, look, what do you guys think? What do you guys think? Which Barton Elite Silicone is your favorite one? And uh, let's move on to the next totally different strap. Okay, this is the Hadley Roma MSA34 black leather croc pattern strappy strap. Uh, crop grain, a little cheapy strap, but I do like it, and uh, it classes it up a little bit. You know, it's not, it's not proper. You're not supposed to have a leather strap on a dive watch, guys. That was almost a song, wasn't it? <laughs> You're not supposed to have a dive watch. No, uh, maybe I should do that later. Anyway, let's just move on. Um, what do you think about this com combination, guys? It's a very weird leathery dive watch combo i think it looks great i think it will look even better without the white stitching uh yeah i wonder if i should i can photoshop this i'm gonna take a screenshot right here hold still as possible and then uh, just kind of photoshop those things out there there you go that looks cool how what do you think about that does that look pretty rad yeah i think it looks good let's, let's put it on my wrist Again, guys, I have a six and a half inch wrist. For those of you who don't know the what I have to go through every day. <laughs> there you go. Ooh. Ooh, yeah, baby. I like that. I like that. That is that is that is fine. That is very fine. I like that. It, it gives the watch a little bit more of a happy, classy feel. Happy classy. Happy classy feel. It makes it uh yeah, I like that. I think without those white stitching it would be a much better situation like the, the previous super awesome Photoshop picture. But that's the Hadley Roma MS834 on my Patty Moss. Okay guys, look at this. We have it on the Red Skills Leather from timestrap.co.uk. And uh, one of my favorite straps. Uh, it's not going to last too long but because uh, I wore the crap out of it. And it's been through a bunch of torrential rains in Japan. <laughs> But it's still one of my favorite things to wear. It does make this watch look absolutely beautiful, in my opinion. What do you think? It's improper. Yes, it's a leather croc grain strap on a diver. So what? Do you, boo-boo, and never mind what everyone else thinks. I think it looks great, and I love wearing it on this strap. Let me put it on my wrist again and show you what I mean, Jelly Bean. It also is very comfortable and uh love wearing this thing there you go look at that mm, mm, mm. 
it does complement the seconds no not the seconds the the minute hand it does complement the minute hand fairly well let's just zoom in show you what i mean uh not zoomed in enough just show you what i mean there you go that's zoomed in very well look at that mm, mm, mm. it complements the minute hand as well as the four markers in the uh, north south east west areas of this dial so look at that that is super nice i like that this watch just makes pretty much everything look amazing it is just that awesome i'm so glad that i put myself in a hole for this watch <laughs> and have to eat ramen to 2033 okay let's do the next one Boom. shiny shinies all right i got this random bracelet off of amazon and it is beautiful it was about 29 dollars and I uh, love, love, it, it just makes me such a freaking, mm, mm. it makes the peanut very gloriously happy, just, just, just shiny and just, just, mm, just so happy in the tingle place. I love that. It's very easy to uh, size. It's a typical bracelet and I think it just looks magnificent. Of course, it's not going to look as great as something that's made for this watch, something that has the lugs. Uh, the end links but i still think it looks fantastic what do you think about this watch uh this bracelet i'm putting it on my wrist and uh i have actually never really worn this look at that that is beautiful mm -mm -mm. i really 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 love the way this looks <laughs> it looks so good okay well um that is my review of these straps on my patty mass. I wanted to put a uh, NATO on here, but I just couldn't find one that I thought would look good. And uh, if I'm not gonna, if I put one that looks terrible, I, I just don't want to show it to you guys. I don't want to put stuff on here that I think you guys will not like. So I didn't find any good NATOs for this watch. And that being said, let's see what the boys have to say. Hey, what's up, guys? What it is? What it was? Who it be like? Where, where, where did it go? One man, one turtle, all day by myself in the hood. No watches, just myself, with beer, gotta go squeak squeak. Okay, Uncle Jimmy, that uh, thanks for that stupid little rant, no problem. And, uh, well, what do you guys think about uh, all these watches, uh, all these straps? Which, which strap combination was your favorite or favorite straps combinations and such? Well, you know, I don't... I don't think I like any of it because because it, I just I don't know you know I don't know I just don't know I got nothing I got nothing I have I bring nothing to the table <laughs> you got nothing you okay let me let me break it down for you let me break it down for you let me break it down for you I like the one with the shiny shiny I like the shiny one the shiny one right there that the shiny one right there that shiny one right there that one is good I like that one it was real good I want to eat it I want to I eat it how come when I want to eat something, you're like, oh, you're stupid. But then when you want to eat something, it's like, oh, cool, everything's cool. Yes, you know, because I'm Uncle Jimmy Turtle, and I'm the best. Don't you know? Don't you know where I'm coming from, Este? I'm Uncle Jimmy Turtle. Okay, well, guys, <laughs> that's just, this is getting, getting really ridiculous now, guys. You guys are trying way too hard. Um, just tell me, oh, Ted, which one, what's your favorite color? Well, I like blue. Okay, well, then there are three different blue ones. Which one do you like? I like blue. Okay. And Ted, uh, Uncle Jimmy, you obviously like the shiny one. I like the shiny one. Okay. So, guys, that's my uh, review of ridiculous, ridiculous review of uh, a bunch of straps on the patty mass. And uh, thanks for watching. May your peanut be happy and have a great day. You didn't do the fade off thing. You didn't do the fade off thing again. What's wrong with you?